Hello shrimp and fish people. In this video I want to show you how I test for ammonia in my shrimp tanks. Uh, the tank on the left that you see on the screen is uh, a tank that I'm currently cycling. It's a 20 gallon long on my shrimp rack and uh, it is at the stage where the ammonia is going to be really high. So I want to show you how I do this. For this test I'm going to be using the API ammonia test kit and uh, it's not my favorite but that's what I have at the moment. I'm going to be using this test tube that comes with the kit and so before I even start the test what I like to do is actually rinse it with the water from the tank that I'm going to be testing. So using a pipette as you can see here, I'm just going to take some water, put it in here, give it a good shake, empty it, okay and then I'm going to be taking another sample of water and filling it up to that line. Something like that. Okay, the next thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be taking the bottle number one. There's two bottles in this test kit and adding eight drops. Okay. Then I'm going to be taking bottle number two, give it a little shake, and add eight drops as well. Okay. Cap it. Shake it for five seconds, they say. And then let it sit for five minutes. Okay, five minutes has passed and now we can compare the results. It's about 2. 2 ppm, so yeah, very toxic. I'm going to be cycling this for a while. I'm going to do 80% water change on it and hopefully the nitrites are going to start increasing soon. At that point I'm going to be testing the nitrites and I'll make another video for that. Uh, and again, once the nitrites are down, my nitrates are going to be up and that's something you're going to be fighting for the rest of the life of the tank. That's why we do water changes. Anyway, so just a short video. Thanks guys for watching and see you next time.